Hi everyone, this is Anne Emery with Excel for Evaluators, and this is the second video tutorial about the IF formula. IF comes in handy when you're recoding your variables. Let's look at an example. So let's pretend as part of your evaluation you surveyed organizations and you asked them how many employees they had, and you need to recode this information to make it a little bit more manageable. So if they had one to three employees, we need to recode that into small, etc. Here is the data. So in a previous video, we looked at the small um, organizations that just had one to three employees. But what do we do about the rest of the response options? Well, we're going to make one monster if formula. We're just going to keep on typing in the same box. Okay, let's add the and formula and just keep on going. So if this value equals four to nine, then we're going to call that a small organization. If not, we'll leave it blank. Okay, that's the second part. Here's the third part. So if, oops, if this cell equals 10 to 19, then we're going to call that a medium organization. If not, leave it blank. And if B2 equals 20, 49, whoops, you have to put quotation marks around in any of your text or numbers that you type in by hand. Then we're going to also call that a medium organization. If, if it doesn't say 20 to 49, we'll leave it blank. And if this equals 50 to 99 employees, then we'll call that a large organization. If not, leave it blank. And if this cell says 100 to 499, then that's a large organization. If not, leave it blank. And the final piece, if this cell equals 500 or more, then that's a large organization. If not, leave it blank. Okay, we'll see if it worked. So far, so good. I don't think I made any typos, but I usually do, so we might see a few of them. Cross your fingers. I think it's good. Let's sort using our filters. I think we're in good shape. So instead of doing that by hand where we could have made a lot of typos, we just used the formula to save us plenty of time. So that's another use of the IF formula. Thank you.